Hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Logan Hutton, voice of Mount Zion Athletics, bringing you live. I just say softball. Tonight we have the Mount Zion Lady Braves taking on the St. Joseph Ogden Spartans. What should be an exciting matchup? Spartans on the season, I believe, are 14 and 5, uh, 15 and 4. So a very solid softball team here. Lady Braves, of course, 14 and 0, undefeated. So St. Joseph looking to hand the Lady Braves their first loss of the season. Mount Zion trying to stay perfect. So joined in the booth tonight with me is Tyson Evans. Howdy, people. Ought to be, ought to be an exciting one. <coughs> what do you think? What do you think we're going to get tonight, Ty? W, of course, but I think... We're definitely going to have to fight for this one. Definitely nothing too easy. But I for sure think that we will get the dub. I'm confident in our team. Uh, Fink on the bump tonight for yep. the Lady Braves. So Mount Zion running out the ace. Of course, with her great defense behind her. All she, Like I said, for Nikki, the last game that we streamed, all, all she had to do is pitch strikes and let her defense back her up. All right. That is not what we, what we want. Not the pitch to the backstop. We don't want that. Leading off for the Spartans. Center fielder number five, Addison Frick. That one. Wow. <laughs> Ding. That one hit foul off the foul pole. Good start for Ella. Look like she's really bringing it in today. Got a good velo on her first pitch. <clears throat> As you can see, she's a, Addison's a little late. Low. One and one. <clears throat> Frick up in the plate, lefty hitter. Good pitch. And called strike two. Pitchers count here. We'll see what Fink gives Frick. What do you think, ball strike? I think Razor Sights go with the ball up. And that one chopped ah. off of the arms of that is uh, oh, Johnson. Yeah. Johnson. That's all right. That'll be a <coughs> single for Frick. That was, that was a nice slap. Yeah. That'll bring up seven, the second Grace baseman, Oster number seven, <coughs> Grace Osterber, or Fur, Osterber. Osterber. Pitches up, ball one. Frick leading off second, no, uh, first, <coughs> no outs. Good pitch. One in wow. there. You know, just like a normal community, this team looks very athletic. I agree. Almost cut on and missed, strike two. So another pitcher's count. Last time we saw one two count, we uh, had a single here. So if we get another weekly hit ball to third, maybe we can roll two. Wow. Rung her up. That is uh, really far outside, but we will take it. Yeah. We will take that. I'm really, hmm. It's like that umpire is really going to favor his left side today. This is the first right-handed hitter that we'll see, so maybe, maybe it could be different. Yeah, let's we'll see what we get. <clears throat> Good pitch. That one in there. Lefties are going to have a fun day today with this guy. Yeah. <laughs> um, this brings up the shortstop number 23, Addy Martini. That one popped up. Talk, come on, talk. And nice. handled by the center fielder. Molly doing it. Good catch. So two outs here in the top half of the first. That'll now bring up the catcher, number 29, McKinney. Emma McKinney. Should be looking to score Frick from first with anything hit deep into the outfield. Nah, she ain't scoring. 
Pesh. I went in there, strike one. Yeah, well, it's definitely hitting, hitting her spots. She was me feeling pretty good today. Yep. She bounced back nicely after that leadoff single. Yep. That's not really on her, though. Like, obviously, errors happen along with the game, but not, I don't think that's on Ella. Ella threw strikes. Yeah. I mean, I wouldn't necessarily call that play an error, but I, I give it this. I would give it the uh, – that one cut on a miss nice. for strike two. I would give it the base hit. Mm -hmm. It was hit hard. Yeah. One-two count, two outs. Another pitch to count. Payoff pitch. Nice spot. Rung her up. Great start for Ella. Good job. So what Was that two strikeouts? Yep, two Ks, one single, and one fly out in the inning. So we'll take a short break. We'll get right back to the action as Lady Braves will come up and take their ABs. Choosing LLCU for your banking needs means choosing to impact your community. At LLCU, we are committed to community investment, donating over $200,000 to nonprofits and volunteering over 2,400 hours to community projects last year. At LLCU, we offer more than checking accounts and loans. We offer a chance to be a part of something bigger. When you bank at LLCU, you bank on making a difference. Visit LLCU.org to become a member and feel good about where you bank. Federally insured by the NCUA. Leading off for the Lady Braves, the pitcher, number five, Ella Fink. Fink here, probably see some slapping, slap action going on. Yep, I agree. Let's see how, the third, how <coughs> close up the third baseman plays. She's in front of the bag, so. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's hard to catch Ella no matter how close you are to the, right. to the plate. And Good ball. Get over her head. Oh, my gosh. That one nice. Way over Go. Her head. Nice. Yeah, lead off double. Great for start. Fink. And ugly looking slide there, but nonetheless. And nice little Selly. Yeah. Nice little Selly. Lead off double. It looked like she was doing a little hula hoop dance. Uh, good start. Uh, I'm, I'm sure she feels good about that one. Yep, that'll bring up two hole hitter. Shortstop number four, Addie Red Rum Rots. Be looking. I mean, the way know. the way that ball was flying right. through the wind. I don't know. Rods puts a power a behind a it. Anything up in the air might go. Oh. Yep. Yep. Back. back and see ya. see ya. Yep. You called it. Anything up in the air is going to go. Great hit by Addy. But no surprise there, of course. No. I would I would be very afraid if I was parked out there. Right. That uh, parked out right. right center field. Great, great start for the Braves, though. Because that'll because here in two batters that'll bring up Chloe Williams and she can hit it that far. Oh, I, oh absolutely. So someone might need a new yep. windshield. Yep. Car, car insurance companies are gonna have a nice night tonight. Mm -hmm. Braves are up two zero now. I could see this being all that like all game long, just dingers left and right. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, like, but like obviously home runs are exciting, but I mean like. They just happen so often, it seems Could like. Could I mean, rule. Right? But we'll see. We'll see. It's very early. That was, oh, Lord. That was in there. Oh. oh, Lord. Well, you yeah. thought she should have. We're going to see a lot of ball in play, I feel like. Thought she should have probably swung at that. 
and for for first pitch, uh, I think it was good to leave. It wasn't her pitch. Yeah, you don't you don't you don't want to swing immediately at a pitch that it's not yours necessarily. Mm-hmm. I mean, she hasn't got to see a whole lot of pitches either. I mean, the two at bats we've seen so far have only been like four pitches combined. Right. Yeah. Cut on a miss. Yeah, they're early. We got the way back today. <coughs> I wonder if Andre's hit one out yet this year. She had. Uh, Pretty sure she has. It's been a little bit. She's due. For sure, she's due. Let's see what we get here. One outside, 2-2. Two, two. Getting a call from healthcare. <laughs> That's always fun. Yep. That one chopped. Real foul. <laughs> really got the way back. Good hustle out of the box. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. So, oh, Johnson here, 2-2 two, two count, no outs. Looking for hers. One, Good leave. Going away, runs the count full, 3-2. and two. Something's got to give here. Cheeseburgers are ready. Stevens on the bump for the Spartans. And a rocky start so far. Let's see if she'll reel it in on the mound. Cheeseburgers are ready indeed. <laughs> They're coming. And that one get grounded there, to short. Get there. Gonna be close. Safe. Ooh. Nope, she pulled off. There you go. All you gotta do is, all, that's all you gotta do, put it in play. Yep. I mean, Audrey legged that one out. Yeah, she that, did. that wasn't even, that was she a strong. She put the wheels on. Yeah, and that was a strong throw from it the uh, shortstop Martini. It was just a little high. Not the first so time. that'll bring up Chloe Williams, and uh -oh. I think all eyes will uh -oh. be on this AB. Here we go. <laughs> Them cars out in right center, you might want to move. Yep. If she gets one, it's going. That one in there, strike one. It's like she's really nailing the outside. <laughs> Batter's going to have to step out towards yeah. the pitch and really take it right center, which is where that wind is blowing at. So Maybe not the best spot Excuse to me. live at. That Good ball. Hit right oh, back. to her. That's going to be doubled up. Wow. Good ball. You can't, you can't be too mad about that. Nope. Hit it hard, just right at, at mm -hmm. the shortstop martini. As she makes the better throw that time. So... Hey, the Spartans get quick two uh, two quick outs there after the leadoff double and then the home home run two run home run by Rods. So we'll see what Carly Teal will bring to the plate. Yep. So Stevens. And she's able. She's she's definitely able to take it out too because she has before. That one in there, strike one. And so I mean, and I feel like if you're a pitcher like Stevens, you might not throw the hardest. You got to try. To, I mean, you're really, gonna live at, really have pinpoint accuracy. Yeah, you're going to live and die on those corners, and so. If you miss a spot, it might get hit hard. Mm -hmm. Like that. Oh, oh, not enough. Nope. That's that wind. Good catch by shortstop. So that'll do it for the first inning of play. Mount Zion scores two on three hits. We will take it to the top half of the second. We'll still see Fink back on the bump, and we'll see the Spartans take their second round of ABs. Decatur Dental Care, located at 3737 East U.S. Route 36, provides general dentistry for the whole family. The dentists, including Dr. Kelly Clark and Dr. Melissa Burnett, are currently accepting new patients. Call 217-423-2400 or visit the website at DecaturDentalCare.com to schedule an appointment. From all the staff at Decatur Dental Care, go Braves! Leading off the top half of the second inning for the Spartans. That'll bring up third baseman, number 24, Haley Brazel, uh, Brazelton. One. It's some definitely, high velo. It's definitely a lot different going from Ella to... Going from uh, Stevens <coughs> to Finn. Yep, there we go. Say St Stevens, more of a location type, you know, yep. pitch to contact, pitch to defense type pitcher. Ella, just straight cheese. 
What type of cheese, though? No, Gouda? No change up. No carb ball. Nothing but that. Nothing but that. What kind of cheese? She's definitely. That's not uh, there. She's definitely a pepper jack. Pepper jack? Yeah. Pe- pepper jack Spicy. cheese. Mm hmm. What? Oh, well. Not, not, not the start the Braves want. Nope. Getting a four pitch walk. Need a walk here for Brazelton. That'll bring up the first baseman, <laughs> Ellie Ward. First baseman number 19, Ellie Ward. I mean, la- last time Fink had a runner on first. She dialed it in and she brought it back. So we'll see what kind of result we get here. Definitely an opportunity to roll up a double play. Yep. I'm not really so sure where that's at. Yeah, I'm a miss for ball one. It seems like she needs to work lower down in the zone for this yeah. guy. That one popped up. Oh, that's one out. Oh, oh. drops it. That's all right. It's all right. It's all right. There's <coughs> um, Byler out in left. Might, might have lost it in the sun. It's and the wind in that wind, that that, yeah. wind, that wind's blowing That's hard. That's tough to make a play on. That'll be first error of the day for the Braves. Puts runners on first and second and brings up the, the designated player number fifteen, Hayden Dahl. First pitch in there, ball one. <clears throat> Good pitch. Called strike one. One and one here. Could we see a triple play? Runners on first and second. That'd be, that'd be awesome. That'd be pretty nice. That'd be pretty awesome. Oh, and got it. One and two. Jolie's always ready to throw down, man. She's always ready to throw. Yeah. I like that. <clears throat> always keeps runners on, t- on their toes. Does not yeah. let them get a lot of leeway. Just seems like her, Julie and her middle infielders weren't really on the same page there. That one cut on and missed. Right by her, good pitch. <clears throat> That's strike three for the first out of the top half of the second. Kelly. That'll bring up the right fielder, number two, Tamara Blackburn Kelly. Now's, now's a good time for a double play. Pull yep. it back. It's still first strike. strike. Can't really do that. Shoot, I don't know if I'd want to uh, throw my hands over the plate when the pitch is coming in that fast anyways. Right. <laughs> that one, that one definitely, had some zip. Yeah, that would definitely break a finger. Um, one looked like it was in. Mm. One and one. Yeah, she's definitely... It'd be well, tough to roll two here. Right. That one cut nice. missed. Good pitch. She does lay down a bunt, though. They definitely need to try to get the lead runner out at third. I mean, I, I would be shocked if she did just with the two-strike count, but that one fouled away. <coughs> and alive, one and two. Blackburn Kelly looking to score Brazelton from second. That one up, two and two. <laughs> Not a bad miss. In that, nope. in that kind of count. Maybe, you know, giving her some high heat, looking to set up something low, get her to chase. Anything on the ground would be nice in the situation. Good that pitch. Get Great there. pitch. Backwards K for the second out. Oh, J Rock's getting the ball. Now there you go. Left fielder number four, Chloe Harper. That'll bring up the left fielder number four, Chloe Harper. Got to give her something to do. I wonder if there's any relation to Bryce. <laughs> I don't know. I guess we'll, I guess we'll see with the swing. No, nope, definitely not. Bryce Harper, don't If she's bunting, nope, no way. <laughs> so first pitch, bunted foul. Would you say Bryce? One. Would you say Bryce Harper's your favorite player? He's my favorite player ever. Yeah. Hmm. Why so? Hits bombs he, and he he's talks. He's good. He hits bombs and he <laughs> talks trash. What else do you you want? That one. Who wow. gets by? Runners will advance. We're good. Just gotta find that zone. Yep. One and one here. Two outs. Yeah, you get two outs anyway. Top yeah. half of the second. Tag up. Is that a play here? So, 
see what we get. One and one. One way up. Wow. Yeah, that, that, was, that was a, a snag. That was a great snag by Jolie. Fink here. Comes set. Lined up in the pitch. Good pitch. Right in there. Great pitch. Man, that pop is. Yeah, that, that was that, nice. That, that, that was a nice loud. pop. It's loud. Mm hmm so twos everywhere, two balls, two strikes, two outs, and inning number two. Oh, she needs to go to the outside here. We'll see what we get. Oh, th sails nope. it. Oh, Brazelton thought about it, but stays back. Count runs full. I mean, this is a true payoff pitch here with two outs, full count. Walk's not really a huge loss here because you no, got Base is open, yep. but I would not want to turn the lineup over and face Frick, right. who... I believe singled in her first A-B. Yeah, she slapped that third. Nice. Backwards oh, K. All right. Well, we'll take it. I'm not so sure if that was the right call, but we'll, <laughs> we'll, we'll, we will sure take it. Definitely take it. So Spartans go, Spartans go scoreless. So Fink gets out of a jam there. Now we'll see what the Lady Braves can do with the bats in their hand. We'll take a short break and be right back to the action. Choosing LLCU for your banking needs means choosing to impact your community. At LLCU, we are committed to community investment, donating over $200,000 to nonprofits and volunteering over 2,400 hours to community projects last year. At LLCU, we offer more than checking accounts and loans. We offer a chance to be a part of something bigger. When you bank at LLCU, you bank on making a difference. Visit LLCU.org to become a member and feel good about where you bank. Federally insured by the NCUA. Leading off the inning for the Lady Braves, the left fielder, number 11, Savannah Byler. Sorry. Stevens here after giving up three hits, two runs in her first bottom half of the inning. And that one lazily cut on and missed, strike mm -hmm. one. Yep. I think Byler kind of got indecisive there, couldn't make up her mind, it just decided to. Give a swing at it. Right. And that one might have got called anyways. So. Yeah. <laughs> I mean. yeah, I'll say that. That's kind of what I was thinking. Here's the pitch. That one rolled. Oh, I, I must have uh, oh, hit her in the box. I was like, I was like Savannah, that's going. Like, that's going. <laughs> but I didn't see that. So 0 2 count early here for Byler. See what you get here, Stevens. Pitcher's count. Here's the pitch. That one wow. called. <laughs> that one called. Was that in the other batter's box? It was, looked pretty close. Crazy. So that'll bring up the catcher, right, number catcher 12, 12, Jolie, Jolie Schaefer. Schaefer. Cool. <laughs> that was a, another zip code. <laughs> yeah, that was. Oof. First pitch just outside, ball one. So, yeah, that's definitely just just because obviously. <laughs> uh. Shut up. <laughs> Stevens with the pitch. That one oh, beat grounded. It out, beat it out. Beat it out. Jolie She's might there. be there. She's there. She's there. Safe. Ew. Oh wow! Must just got a better step. Yep. I mean, it was a it was a strong throw there mm -hmm. from Martini. Mm -hmm. that close play. Yeah, she's definitely got a uh, strong arm. What is the saying? Tie goes to the hitter. Runner. Right runner. Technically. Yeah. That'll bring up the right fielder, number nine, Avalyn Ethel. Went in there, strike one. That one looks like a breaking ball. I got a wrinkle to it. All right. Must not have been the pitch that she wanted. No. I mean, hey, Stevens bounced back. She's going one, two so far yeah. in this inning. Yeah. Yes, she has. That one grounded. Get through. That's going to get yep. through the hole. Get through the gap. Be a get hit by Ethel. Two out, base hit oh, for oh, oh oh yep and she oh. will take two on, on a on a missed throw to the pitcher, good base running there by Ethel. So be a single and she'll take this she'll take two on there. 
So that'll bring up Molly Doolin, mm, 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 mm. center fielder. Come on. Mm, mm, mm. That one swan missed. Stevens with the pitch. One with low. Uh -oh. Snap throw. Got her. Uh oh, go, going to get uh -oh, through. Uh -oh. Thought huh? they might have sent. F I know. I, I, was going, I was thinking. I would not. But, I, I would not have been opposed to Coach Blakey sending her. But yeah, but uh, maybe just you know, thought smart. two outs. Don't yeah. want to risk it. Right. Just playing it smart. That was lucky situation for Ethel not getting yeah. picked off there. That one up. Two one. Stevens now with the pitch. That one hits softly. Get there, get there, get there, get there, get there. Oh, call her out at first. Well, that she definitely makes that routine play and make it super close with that with, with that speed that she's got. Yeah. So the Braves go down scoreless on one hit. Ella Fink should be back up on the bump here to start the third. We'll see what we get. See if she can hold this two nothing lead. We'll be right back. Leading off for the Spartans, Addison Frick. Yep, back over to the top of the order. Ooh. There you go, great first pitch. Fink <coughs> sailed the first one. A little, might be a little, I'm excited, a little jumpy. It looked like she wanted to throw that one as hard as she could. All right. Just lost a grip of it. Here's pitch. That one pitch. in there. One, one. Fink with the 1-1. One, one. one up. Here's the 2-1. Two, one. That one hit foul. Two and two. Nice bat speed there from Frick. Right. She turned them hands over quick. Yeah, but she was definitely late. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's hard to catch up with that velocity. So, two and two. Personally, skill issue. <laughs> Here's the pitch. That one yep. Rung her yep. up. He's been calling that all day. I'll take it. Except when we're hitting. Then we don't, <laughs> then we, then we don't like that. Right. We'll take it for the defense. Good start for Ella. Better than last inning for sure. That'll bring up second baseman Grace Osterfer. I feel like every team has such unique last names except for ours. We're basic. Now right. We fouled back. Basic white girls. Okay. Think the O one. That one fouled back again. 0-2. Oh, Monsterfer looks like she's choking up just a little bit on that bat. That's what you got to do. And an 0-2 count against a pitcher like Ella. 
Got high velocity. You got to choke up. That one sailed over the catcher's head for one and two. What a pitch. Here's the one two. That one grounded. Yep. Field by play. Williams. And Good job by Chloe. The second out. Good pitching by Ella, too. Yeah. Tell you what, we were flying through this one. I, 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 that's what I'm saying. I don't think we're just really going by through this game. Well, that'll bring up the shortstop, Addy Martini. Do you think your favorite drinks martinis? Just no. She's underage. Wait, well, is there such thing as like a, what's the word? Virgin martini? Yeah. I guess you just like make your own, I guess. <laughs> I don't know, Tyson. I'll bet you, you can just like put like Gatorade or something <laughs> in, in a cup and put some olives on a stick in it and call it a martini, I guess. Oh my goodness. It's first pitch fouled away. A one count, two outs. Fink looking to go to uh, close out the side. One, two, three. That one good, in there. Good pitch. Oh, oh, and two. Two outs here in the top half of the third. Here's the pitch. That one popped up. I'll oh, make the play, Addy. It's going to be a tough play. Spinner ball throws uh, it away. That, that's a hard play to make. And she will take second. That's 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 just unfortunate. She got a lucky little blooper over Ella. Yeah. I hate those. Yeah, well, if you're the Spartans, you'll take the base. And that'll bring up your four hole. Number 29, Emma McKinney. And, I mean... The way the wind's blowing, she's batting the four spot. I reckon if she gets a hold of anything, we could be, be seeing a tie ball game. Well, we hope, we hope not. No, so we just got to execute the pitches, get out of the inning with only one runner on. What did you do last time? I can't remember what she did last time. Couldn't tell you. Pop out. No, maybe. Uh, tough play for Teal. Uh. Dropped. It's going to score a run. Well, shoot. That's not good. Nope. So they are have drawn, gotten their first run of the game. Braves now lead two to one. St. Joseph and Ogden oh, showing why they're, they're uh, well above 500 on the season, battling back. Man, they really have not put the ball too well in play, though. No, but taking advantage of the Braves' errors. Errors. Already three. Mm -hmm. Three errors for three innings. Not a great yep. score line so nope. far. That'll bring up the third baseman. Allie Brazelton. I'm not sure what we're waiting on for. Are we doing a sub? Oh, it could be a oh, pinch runner. Okay. We are, uh, well, we, we are not sure who came in the run for the catcher, but sorry about that. We were not informed of this person. No biggie. I'm trying to see the number. Well, number 30. We'll go with that. Number 30 takes second. Wild pitch. Come on, Ella. You got this. Braves starting to <clears throat> starting to shake a little bit. They got to get things locked back in and yep. execute. Yep. Duffy, get out of the sinning. That's Duffy, all you got to do. They feel a little rusty to start at this game. The pitch down low. 2 0 count. Good hitters count here for Brazelton. Looking to get her pitch here. Looking to score the runner from second and make this a tie ball game. One up. 3 0. Oh, you got an open base. So, yeah. like I said before, hurt. Might be working around her. Walk, walk might not hurt too bad. Nope. She's there. not working around her. Strike one. She is not ducking the smoke, <laughs> as those youngins say nowadays. Here's the three-one. Good Caught pitch. And missed. Good pitch. Come on. Fink so battling back, bringing it to a full count. Come on, put her down to the box. Fink, payoff pitch. That one hit to left. That's gonna go. Oh, wow. That thing was cranked. Two-run shot. 
I was not expecting that at all. Holy cow. That thing was hit yep. hard. Brazelton got all of that one and pulled it in the wind, which, funny enough, the wind which is going the yeah. opposite way. She hit it into the wind and got it out. So, hmm. Brazelton unloads the bases with a two run shot uh. and gives St. Joseph Ogden the lead. Well, I think just put it a little bit too good there in that kind of count. Yeah, that'll bring up the first baseman, Ellie Ward. She's looking to duplicate what Brazelton just did up at the plate. Um, just looking to get out of the inning with any more, with any less, da with less damage. Right. That one in there. Ball one. Thank you. Yep. 2-0. 2-0? Yeah. Thank you. Here's the 2-0. That one in there for strike wow. one. Some progress. Quite the strike zone. A <laughs> little, little, little funky. Well, little, little, little is a little understatement. Yeah. Pink battling back. Evens up the count. Two and two. Man, uh, the Spartans, two hits, three runs. That's a formula for success. Uh -huh. I'm fouled back, staying alive. I suppose you, I suppose you didn't get scared by that. It wasn't as close to my face. Oh, I got you. <laughs> Fink now with the chance. Get out of the inning. 2-2 two, two, count. That one grounded foul. We'll do it again. It's hard hit. Ward staying alive. Trying to extend this inning. Keep the two-out rally going. She needs to put this pitch low and outside. He's been calling it all game, and that's. I feel like a lot of these hitters aren't able to be able to catch up with that speed and still be able to. Well, we'll take that too. Yep. Strike three, swinging. That'll take us to the bottom half of the third inning. Spartans not giving up. Yep. Spartans score th uh, three on one hit. Wow. So. It's quite the set line. That'll take us to the bottom half of the third. Lady Braves are looking to take that lead back, and Stevens will still be on the bump for the Spartans. So we'll take a short break, and we'll be right back for the start of the bottom half of the third. Leading off the bottom half of the third, the pitcher, number five, Ella Fink. I'm sure she's going to be coming up with a little aggression. Right, I agree. Hopefully, hopefully she can release that in the ball. Yep. Stevens out there. Going to throw the third. That one. Wow. That was a lofting, like looping almost curveball. I think I can throw faster than that with my left hand. <laughs> Jeez, Tyson. I mean, it dropped right in there, though. It was like that one yep, hit weakly yep, yep, the third. Yeah, she's there. They're not even going to be close. Infield single for Ella Fink. Bring up Addison Rotz. Nope, she lost her little thigh strap thing. Time, Blue. Oh, we've got to toss on the oven mitt now. Yep, oven mitt going on. we got a red rum rots who hit a home run last at bat. Hopefully she can do it again, get the leads back. If it's low, ball one. So, I mean, we thought, you know, with Stevens giving up two in the bottom half of the first, like um, it might not be much of a game. Mm -hmm. But right. she battled back, throw, throwing up a donut. That one Good wrote ball. hard. Oh, right to her. Oh, my gosh. Double up again. Off. Yep. Dude. That's just unfortunate. But, I mean. Wow. I'm telling you, these Spartans, 
the the pitching might not be is their strong suit, but they can hit and they play good defense. <laughs> so yeah. I mean, yeah. They're giving the Braves a run for the money so far. So with a runner on, that's gone now. That'll bring up Audrey Johnson with two outs here. We'll be looking to Man, that get a hurts. two-out rally going. That hurts. Oh, that definitely does hurt. It's like a shot. Wow, I'm surprised they didn't call that. <laughs> An outside ball one. This team's good. This team's really impressing me. Mm -hmm. Here's second pitch. That one grounded. That's a single. Oh, good there you go. Good job. Two out single for Johnson. Come That'll on. bring up Come on, Chloe, Chloe Williams. It's time for Clo Bomb. Clo Bomb? It's time for Clo Bomb. That would be nice. That would definitely turn the tides of the way this game's going and the way the momentum's right. shi uh, right. shifting. Take like the bar in the in uh, Madden. You know, it, it, um, not, you know what I'm talking nope, about. Nope, nope, nope. You're you know done. what I'm talking You're about. Done. You're done. One slow and low. Oh. Johnson got caught. Why? Why? So that'll do it for the third inning of play. That's it. Braves. Interesting, interesting, interesting play. Braves score none on two hits, so that'll take us to the top half of the fourth. I'm sure we'll probably see Fink out there again. I believe we will. Yep, I see her coming back out there. So we'll take a short break and get right back to the action as Fink will try to limit the Spartans from advancing that lead anymore. Choosing LLCU for your banking needs means choosing to impact your community. At LLCU, we are committed to community investment, donating over $200,000 to nonprofits and volunteering over 2,400 hours to community projects last year. At LLCU, we offer more than checking accounts and loans. We offer a chance to be a part of something bigger. When you bank at LLCU, you bank on making a difference. Visit LLCU.org to become a member and feel good about where you bank. Federally insured by the NCUA. Leading off the top half of the fourth for the Spartans, Hayden Dahl. That one hit hard into the gap. It's a one hopper off the wall. She's looked to go two. Come on, get her out. Ooh, Gunder. <sighs> but she couldn't bring it up with the ball, so that'll be. That was a great throw by Ethel, double. though. That was a really good throw. That was a rope. Well, good start for the Spartans as they will get a lead off uh, double. double. Oh, that was a good. That was a great swing. Hit that ball right where it was pitched. Mm -hmm. Put it right in the gap. One hop to the fence. That'll bring up Tamara Blackburn Kelly, looking to score a doll from second. Good, good stop by Jolie. Here's the pitch. That one. Hit foul, bunted foul. <coughs> Third and first baseman playing way up. Oh, we really haven't seen her swing too much. No. Struck out in her last AB, I do believe. Mm -hmm. I believe it was a it was a backwards K. Oh, there we go. That was a hack right there. She, she, she definitely has a powerful swing. That, was, that wasn't even a bad looking swing either. Mm -hmm. I liked it. How was that car parked like that on that hill? You see the it? truck or the no, all the way out there on the other field. Probably with the emergency or uh, okay, the brakes on. What is it called? The uh, parking brake. Parking brake. I, I I don't even know how that. Sorry, um, I'm completely confused by that. <laughs> Anyways, the 2-2 count, no <clears throat> outs here. Dahl off second. Blackburn Kelly looking to score. And that one just Wow, up. wow, wow, wow. Think you think a, we should have got that call? Yep. That is right. It was up. definitely close. That's definitely in the zone. You, oh. you, you, must, you must have a lower zone. Yep, count runs full. One by you. Missed. In a throw down. Uh-oh, we, we got pickle. Runner, runner, throw it. 
Yep, and got her. Slide nice. Short. So Strike him out, throw him out, baby. Let's go. That's huge. That's a double play. As Tyson is Great throw very by excited Jolie. about it. Oh, quick complaining. She's out. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I mean, I don't even think there should be a discussion here. Her slide was short of the bag anyways. That they're complaining because they think Audrey blocked her. I, I mean, mean, she's going for the ball. Yeah, she she was she was in front of her, but uh, it's a discussion. Because looking back on it, it was I can see why they think that, but I don't think no, there's enough. Absolutely not. I don't. There's definitely no. not enough to overturn no. that decision. As long as she completely blocked the bag. Thank you, thank you. Great throw by Jolie. Great, great idea. Too. It completely caught her, caught her off guard on, yeah. on the base pass and got her second out. I'm sure Ella appreciates that. Mm -hmm. That'll oh. bring up the left fielder, Chloe Harper. I would tell Jolie thank you in the dugout after this inning for that. It was a great, it was a great play all around. Mm -hmm. Harper trying to turn the lineup over here. Two outs. Lays one Pop down. straight Pops up. Get there, Jolie. Up, Jolie. Oh, yes. What a catch. I didn't even see that. but That was a great catch. Sounded like it was nice. Great inning for, for Schaefer there. Made some nice plays there on defense. Now Lady Braves will come back up to the plate, looking to take back the lead here. And Stevenson will be throwing the fourth. So we'll take a short break and get right back to the action. Leading off the bottom half of the inning is, oh my gosh, Kyle Schwarber and Trey Turner went back to back on the Rockies. Let's go. <laughs> but, um, leading off the bottom half of the inning for the fourth, number 20, Chloe Williams. Well, Chloe Baum. Chloe Baum is due. Good spot for it. It would keep up the, the upward trend here for the Braves after a nice right. inning on defense. She made field. a great couple plays. Oh, um, my gosh. Got the outside a little bit. I'm pretty sure that was in the batter's box. No, nah, I don't think it was quite that far, but it was it was definitely it was outside. Cut on a missed strike, too. She wanted that one. Golf swing. Uh, yep. And she got her, she, she got her driver in hand. <laughs> so 0-2. Williams here looking to protect the plate. Get back into this AB. And go, 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 go. Get there, get there, get there, get there. Get there. Williams hustling. Yep. She'll be there. We'll take that. So. Good hustle by Chloe. Technically a strikeout, but she'll advance. Chloe bomb. <laughs> hey, base runners are king. That'll bring up second baseman Carly Teal. There, wow. strike one. Thought she might have offered it. That mm -hmm. one, that one looked, mm -hmm. that one looked good for. Oh, her. Yep, a little too good. I swear, I swear, those are the ones that are hardest ones to hit. The ones that you know are just perfect. Get, one, oh, oh, get there, softly. get there. Safe to be out. Yeah, <sighs> I agree. With, well, great play by the pitcher. I agree with that call. But a little advance the runner, nonetheless, puts her in scoring position, and then it'll bring up. Savannah Byler. Now back left 
If you had to choose a walk-up song, what would it be? Hmm. I'll, I'll, I'll get back to you on all that. Right, all right. I'll, I'll let you think. That one hit. And that'll advance the runner again. Good play. So with two outs here. I'll take the movement. Johnson. Well, excuse me. Clay Williams. <laughs> I don't know where I got Johnson from. Uh, Audrey, I guess. Chloe Williams leading off third, and that'll bring up the catcher, Joey Schaefer. RBI opportunity yep. to make this game tied. And what they say, seven hole is the three spot of the bottom of the lineup. Can't remember if I've ever heard that or not. <laughs> but um, um, I, I believe you. And no, get there, get there, get there. She, she got Shaler. a strong arm, though. Oh, nope. Wow, that was great, a close play. Great, that was a great throw. Great, great play by the shortstop. So the Braves go down scoreless on no hits. That'll take us to the top half of the fifth. Lady Braves still trying this one, three to two. I want to see before we take a break here if uh, who's going to be pitching for the Braves and it's still going to be Fink. So take a short break and we'll be right back. Same thing. So leading off the inning is Addison Frick. The Spartans, that pitch bounced low in the dirt for ball one. Very traditional type, I would say, softball, baseball game today. Not a lot of hits, not a lot of runs. Good uh, pitcher duel, defensive game. Got a couple homers. Fink with the 1-0. That one popped up foul. Johnson mm. and Schaefer were both in the area. Neither of them could Good effort. come down with it. Makes the count one and one. Me personally, I'm diving. <laughs> I'm catching that. Yeah, you know, like, because I'm him. I'll give I'll give you the diving part. I don't know about the catching part. <laughs> <laughs> one one count. Here's the pitch. So slap. Ooh, Good nice play. little play. That'll oh, be wow. the first out. Good play by Ella. Well, kind of just stuck that paw down there, brought it up, threw it to first. That'll bring up the second baseman, Grace Osterper. What's up, brother? Fink here. That one fouled away. That was a nice healthy cut. That was a that was a velo on it too. That pitch was moving. Osterberg looking to get on, extend this lead, get some insurance runs going. That one fouled back again. Another, she's, another nice yeah. healthy cut. I mean, she's she's getting on there. She does not doesn't quite have the timing lined up yet. But with an 0-2 count, she have to worry less about timing and more about contact protecting this mm -hmm. plate. That one cut on and missed. Yeah, Strike catch. three. <clears throat> Some good start to the right. inning here for Fink. That'll bring up Addy Martini. Two up, two down. See, she got to two outs in the last uh, top half mm -hmm. inning, and that one almost got away from her, but she's able to reel it in, so see what she can do with Martini. That one. Good first pitch. In there called strike one. Fink here with the 0-1. One low. One and one. Mm 
Here's the pitch. Low. 2 1. Not a bad miss. Mm -mm, not a bad miss at all. Here's the 2 1. That one chopped, fielded by Johnson. It's probably nice. Good, That'll do it. Good catch by Klobom. I'll do it for our top half of the fifth inning. Braves going to come back up to the plate looking to take this lead. Haven't seen a run scored from Mount Zion since the first inning. Wow. So we're going to see due. how they do. Do for some runs. There we go. Leading off the bottom half of the fifth, it'll be the right fielder, Avalyn Ethel. Here's the first pitch. Ethel shows bunt. Doesn't get there. It'll be strike one. He was leaning for that one. She singled last time, I believe, in the gap between shorts up and thirds. So. Mm -hmm. I'm sure she's hoping. Hoping the actually a two out two out single yeah I'm sure she's hoping to get a maybe a double uh, double or better that one she just missed one one here Stevens still on the bump for the Spartans that one oh, dribbled get there get there get there get there be a tough play throw got wow. her. That was a nice throw, too, by... Um, nice throw on the run from third baseman. Brazelton, third baseman, yeah. So, Avalon Ethel's retired. That'll bring up the center fielder, Molly Doolin. Mm -hmm. Now that is number one, Molly Doolin. Here's the pitch. Flipped in there for a ball. Do you ever think of your, you uh, your walk-up song that you would choose? No, not yet. I'll get back to you after the end of this game. <laughs> at, at the end of the game? I'm too locked in right now. Okay. That one. Oh, and away. 2-0. -oh. A walk here would be great out of doing. Just to get a base runner. Well, I guess I'm going to tell you mine. I kind of just thought about this, so you know the song. Uh, oh, I can't remember. Like, like I don't want to say the lyric song, but it's like, it, it's like, dun, 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 uh, dun, that's a touchy roll. I, I don't know what you've been told. And ooh, got yeah. her. Wow. At first, but no, I, I can't. Uh, can't say I know what that song is, Ty. I'm, I'm sure if I played it to you, you, you would know. But that'd be mine. And I'll turn the lineup over and bring up Ella Fink no, with two outs. Five, Looking to get a little two-out rally here. We're getting down to the wire. Braves going to need to get something going here. Mm -hmm. I would say hit it anywhere except for the shortstop. Yeah. I mean, even with faint speed and being a left-handed hitter, but mm -hmm. she does have a cannon. That one hit. Oh, that might drop in it. Mm, nope. Wow, great catch by the center fielder. Defense wins championships, so the Braves will go down. No hits, no scores here in the bottom half of the fifth. That will take us to the top half of the sixth inning. I'm sure we'll see Fink back out there. So, take a short break, and we'll be right back.
Leading off for top six, the catcher Emma McKinney. First pitch, low, ball one. Pink here looking to keep up what she's been doing ever after she put up that three spot in the top half of the third. She's thrown two scoreless innings here. She'll be looking to continue that trend. Last inning she went one, two, three. So right. just try to get back up to the plate as quick as possible. I agree. That one cut on a minute straight to <clears throat> almost almost looked like she had McKinney reaching for that one. Right. One, two, pitchers count. That one fouled back. Good cut. Mm -hmm. Healthy hack. Stays alive, one and two. I think that one grounded to Teal. And be Routine play for the first out. Quick out. So that'll bring up third baseman Hallie Brazelton. She homered back in the third inning. Yeah, she did. So we'll see what she will bring up to the plate here. Hopefully not the same thing. Yeah, she'll definitely be looking to duplicate what she did, but I think going to try to maybe maybe be a, little, be a little tentative with this hitter. That one in for a ball. Say, so, I mean, and like, you know, the battle between pitcher and hitter, it's a... Yeah, it's obviously it's a physical sport, but the mental battle and the way your psyche has to change after someone goes yard off you, I mean, it's, it's definitely in our mind right now. All right. She just have to try to block it out. That one has popped up. Good call. Rots makes the play. Good play by Rots. That'll be two outs. Yep, so Battleton sat down. That'll bring up 19, Ellie Ward. I wonder how JV's doing. Was they're they're playing on the other field over there? Yeah. Hopefully they're doing well. Better than us right now, I hope. That one. There we go. Way outside. Ball one. Might have just lost the grip on that one. Just really let loose. <coughs> Think now with the one out. One grounded, fielded by Johnson. Throw to first, and that'll do it. Good for play. Our top right. half of the sixth. Time to, time to score some runs. It's been a, it's been too long. Yep. So we'll take a short break. Get right back to the action as the Braves will try to cut into that lead and or take the lead. So we'll be right back. Hoorah! Decatur Dental Care, located at 3737 East U.S. Route 36, provides general dentistry for the whole family. The dentists, including Dr. Kelly Clark and Dr. Melissa Burnett, are currently accepting new patients. Call 217-423-2400 or visit the website at DecaturDentalCare.com to schedule an appointment. From all the staff at Decatur Dental Care, go Braves! Leading off the bottom half of the sixth inning for the Lady Braves, Addie Rotz. She went yard earlier in this game. Be looking to repeat that same outcome as that first pitch is in there. Low and away, ball yep. one. Tough, yeah. Good hitter to start the inning with. Yep. I can't believe they haven't scored a run since the very first I inning. It's, been, it's weird. I don't like it. That one popped up, foul. She's... She reached for that one. Yep. <clears throat> you're gonna, you're gonna swing, and something like that. You might as well try to make contact. All right. That one. Oh. Oh. <laughs> that one might have been in the other All batter's right. box. You for real? <laughs> this counts one and two. Came in. You have to have a broomstick to hit that. <laughs> 
Mr. Evans definitely upset with that last call. I was about the same pitch. Yeah. That one in there evens up the count, two and two. That one grounded hard, be foul. It's here, two and two. Looking to get on any way she can. Here's a two two. That one. Good leaf. Blown away. That was. That probably was like the hardest pitch ever to lay off of. <laughs> Count runs full, three and two. Base hit ball four here for the Lady Braves. This is a big. This is a big pitch right here. That one runs inside. And mm, be a walk. Man, I don't know. That, that looked really good from up here. Yeah. <laughs> Whenever he pointed, I thought he I called know. it a strike, I and know. I was like, whoa. whoa. <laughs> so that'll bring that up. too close to leave for yeah. a full count. That'll bring up Audrey Johnson here. Could see some movement over here at first from Rots. He's got good speed. That first pitch in there, called strike one. She doesn't seem to have a huge aggressive lead, so. I don't think she's looking to steal right now. Well, I don't think you can even get a lead off in softball, can you? Well, I mean, like, after she pitched. Uh oh. Don't cut on a miss. Strike two. Come on, Audrey. Oh, there's my sister. Re Brandley. Oh, yeah. So, 0 oh, 2. Here's the pitch. That one Good ball. hard through the infield. Oh, my Flipped gosh. Flipped Oh, my gosh. What a double play that was. That was absolutely beautiful. Martini out there. Wow. Grabbed it. It was hit hard through the infield. Flipped it to the uh, second baseman, uh, Osterber. That was, Throw to first. That was a great double play. I, 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 I don't even know what to say about that. That was just an unfortunate and great hit. Defense wins Audrey. championships. Crazy because that... Well, I'm sure she was a little bit closer, but she was so far off the bag. That thing was hit so hard, too. Coley Williams needs to hit a bomb right now. <laughs> and this momentum is pretty far on the mm -hmm. St. Joe side. Williams' home run here would be pretty electric. That would be pretty electric. So 1 0 count. Here's the pitch. 1 low, 2 0. This is definitely not the game I was expecting, but <laughs> it it's definitely keeps it action packed. Yeah, well, it's, not the, it's not the game anyone's expecting. You know, first inning, scored two runs and made it look pretty good, mm -hmm. and then been shut out since. One blowing away. 3 0 count. I think she's scared to pitch to her. I mean, with a base open and two outs, I'm not I wouldn't want to I wouldn't want to pitch to her either. Here's the 3 0. Mm. That'll be a walk. Four pitches. So Williams. Oh, that was voice crack. She'll get on and that'll bring up Teal. Oh, Princess Awkward running. So it'll be Rocky pinch running out or courtesy running at first. What's like, is there really any difference or is it, is it what? courtesy running, pinch running, the way, any way you say it? Yeah, it's courtesy runner. I mean, you don't hear that as much as pinch runner. Yeah. I mean, in baseball, I only ever hear pinch runner, but yeah. in softball, I hear courtesy <coughs> runner a lot. Yeah. So Teal here, now with a runner on with some decent speed. Yeah. Anything hit hard could potentially tie this one up or put right. both runners in scoring position. Right. You definitely hear both, uh, courtesy and pinch runner. Stevens, it's a pitch. That one up. One zero. That one grounded get hard. There. Gonna get oh diving just the underneath your glove. Good hit by Teal. Oh, yeah. get back on the leg. So runners on first and second, and that'll bring up Savannah Byler. This is a big spot right here. Yep, big spot. See what to make of it. The freshman <coughs> and getting some words of wisdom from Coach Greg. Uh, Craig is it Greg? Craig Blakey? It's Greg. Greg. I always call him Mr. Blakey. I, I, 
have that much respect for him. So Coach Blakey, some words of wisdom to Savannah Byler. Big spot here, two outs, runner in scoring position, chance to you know, tie the game, take the lead. Here's first, that one called, strike one. Yeah, she's definitely being J Rock being aggressive on second there with her with her lead after the throw. Here's the pitch. That one oh, get through, get hard. Through. Yes, get go, through. go, 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 go. Gonna send Rocky home. Throw at the plate. She's gonna be there. Nice. Great hit by Savannah. So one Great run hit. single for nice. Savvy That's Byler. Huge. And the Braves are tied it back up at three three and three. So a nice Great clutch job. spot from the freshman Byler. And um Nice base running there from Rocky. Mm -hmm. All tied up here. New ball game. Yep. Oh, oh. Zero to zero. That'll bring up Jelly Schaefer. Cero, Cero in Spanish. What about a, a, a Jolie bomb? Joe bomb? I've seen it happen before. I know it's because yep. she's capable of it. One low. Ball one. I'm just looking for a ball in the outfield. Yeah, ball, nice, nice hard hit ball in the gap. Teal's got, teal's got wheels. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that kind of rhymed. That Get one. down. Oh. Pulled that one. Stevens with the 1-1. One, one. That one hit. Get through. Ooh, go, go get the, wow. Oh, it gets the flip at second. What a heads-up play by Martini, the shortstop. She's been having Way to a, stay with it. Yeah, she's been having a great game today. So, but the Braves. Bring it back. 0-0. Zero, zero. Tie it Top, up. Tie ball game. This is a, this is a huge defensive yeah. inning for Braves. Then I want to put up a zero spot here. Mm -hmm. So, we'll take a short break and. I'll be back. See, see what we get here. Fink still on the mound. Ready like, to shove it. Like this move from Rocky, showing confidence in her girl. She's thrown three straight scoreless innings. See if she can make it four. We'll take a quick break and be right back. Leading off for the Spartans, Hayden Dahl. She had a nice double into the right center gap. Her last A-B. There you go. First pitch was bounced. That one up and away, 2-0. And grounded up the middle for a leadoff mm. single. So double you play opportunities in order now. Can't do too much about that. Just nope. Just a just a decent hit. And I think yeah, Audrey ought to be playing real close here. Right. That'll bring up Tamara Blackburn Kelly. She's shown bunt quite a few times here today, and yeah, she has. Be a great spot for it here too. She want to advance Doll up to second.
Not sure what's happening here. They get a pinch oh, runner here. No, number 30, the number no 30. name. John Doe. Not bad, right? Door number two, Tamara Blackburn Kelly. Pitch. Oh, oh, she's swinging. Missed. All right. She's Strike swinging. One. Here's the bunt. Pulled back. 1-1. One, one. Think with the pitch. Oh Open no. again, pulled back. Ball will get by her. Dahl will move up to second. That's not good. Nope. That moves count to two and one. Can't be having that. Dahl leading off especially, second. Especially now because if she lays down the bunt, it gives the opportunity for the runner on second to get the third. Even closer to home. Yeah. Here's the two one. That one low. Mm. Three one count. Think got to execute here. All the way back. I mean, with the base open, a walk isn't the worst thing in the world, but I mean, it allows the force to be at third now, too. Yeah. That one just up. I thought He's that out. one might have got there. I but know. So that'll be a walk right. there for uh, Tamara Blackburn Kelly, and that'll bring up bring up Chloe Harper, force now at every base in play. Pinch hitter. Pinch hitter. Get a pin this hitter. is number 16. We're getting a name right now. I mean, Mound is it too? Janoush. AJ Janoush is pinch running for See, Tamara. Such, so, such unique names. For Tamara Blackburn Kelly. We're going to get a mound visit from the Braves here, so we'll take a quick break and be right back. Excuse me, not a pinch runner. Excuse me, uh, uh, pinch hitter. AJ. Janoush is pinch hitting Janush. for Chloe Harper. Come on, we need it out here. That one hit foul. Pretty healthy hack for a first swing. Strike one. Here's the 0-1. That one grounded up the middle. Couldn't oh, bring it up no. as Ross. And that'll load up the bases. That's all right. Just got to get the force set at home now. I think I called that one. Mm. What did you call that a hit or an error? Yeah, it's an error. What, what happened? They got called. Someone got called out at third. Did she go out of the base pass? I'm not sure. I'm not sure what the... Well, St. Well, Joseph Ogden is the the parents right next to us are very upset. Yeah, they angry. Oh my gosh, she actually called them out. She must have must have been in the way of the play. Wow. Well, we'll take that out for sure. Yeah, that'll work. So, wait. Well, they'll still turn the lineup over and bring up Addison Frick. All Chance right. here to hey, new score life. a run. I'm so confused. That pitch was low, ball one. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not sure why they called that, but I'm not sure. They just called her out. She must have interfered with the play for Roths at shortstop. Enough to call her out. That one fouled back, one and one. Interesting. I 
get some more talk. Looks like we're going to get another pinch runner in. Looks like number four will come in the run first. Come in the run for... I'm not sure who it was. Um, Danush. Danush. Let's see what that car in center field is definitely in a dangerous spot. That's his very dangerous spot. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not sure if you interfered with her either, but we'll for sure take it, I guess. That one down, 2-2-1. Two, two, one. Big spot here. Defense definitely got to be on their toes. Yep. Good Cut pitch. on this. Strike two. Pitch. Come on. Two balls, two strikes here. One out. Top half of the seventh. Strikeout here is Very absolutely big. huge. That's Tur slap in the middle. Flip to second. Not yeah. going to be a play. We'll, we'll take the out. So that'll put runners on the corners <clears> as <throat> Harper will reach on the fielder's choice. So with two outs here, runners on the corners. That'll bring up number seven, Grace Osterberg. This is a huge spot for the hitter, huge spot for the pitcher. You got two outs, though. So yep. I'm just going to make the play. There's a pitch. No one fouled away. No one won. And this is why I love baseball slash softball. These moments right here. How can you not be romantic about it? Here's the old one. That one. That's not a bad pitch, man. That's not a bad pitch at all. I miss, and she's um, slapping at it a little bit. She's stepping up. Mm -hmm. Son is definitely not helping the fielders right now. Mm. That one almost got away. That would have been bad. Two been one, really bad. <coughs> Think. Just kind of take a deep breath. Calm down. Find your spot. Yep. Okay. Don't get too overwhelmed. Yep. That one wow. missed. He has called that all game, I believe. Yeah, 3-1. Unbelievable. You cannot be inconsistent like that. Not at all. You can't call stuff like that and then not call it later on in the game when, when the time matters. Oh, Hit hard. That's going to go. Nope, that's in. Couldn't, oh. make, couldn't come down with it. That's score one. Looks like they will It'll be a two send run them. That'll be, wow. They take a 5-3 lead. So it's a good hit. That's a big spot. Pitcher versus batter, and Osterber came up big in that one. Yep. That'll bring up Addy Martini. All right, we're good. Just going to get the third out. That one in there, strike one. I'm not sure what the confusion is on that pitch. I mean, that looked like a perfect strike to me. Yeah. Nice. Oh, oh. Here, here she's going to come for it. And she will be safe. So, on the three runs. The run scored there on the wild pitch. <sighs> so, Fink, looking to just get out of this inning, get this last out. Just yep. Feels like they've been in this spot for an eternity. Just trying to get out of here. Out back. That one got me. <laughs> Darren, so one. Oh one. What? Oh one. Oh, and I'm tweaking. Hang on, I'm tweaking. My bad. <laughs> that one grounded. Oh, nope, not grounded. My gosh. Just can't catch a break. Nope. Little bloop single. I feel like that was not even hit on the barrel. That was the end of the bat. Oh, yeah, it was definitely. He definitely capped it there. Or she capped it, sorry. No cap. So that'll bring up Emma McKinley. McKinney. Two outs here. This one's starting to get away from the Braves. Going to have to lock in. Here's pitch. Cut on a miss strike one.
A one. That one was. That one had some velo on it, just a little up. Yeah, I'm sure. Uh, Fink's a little frustrated. Yeah, I'd be too. That one, getting away from Schaefer, and runner will advance to second on the wild pitch. So Martini will take two there. Two one count, two outs, top half of the seventh inning. That one fouled off. That yeah. might hit a car. Might have, no. nope. Just too much. <clears throat> Chase Fink gonna run after it. Count runs even, two and two. Fink looked like he might have showed up late. Showed up after baseball practice. Come watch his sister play. And that one got off of Schaefer's mask. <coughs> and another throw down low. Martini will take third. So full count. Full count here. Something's got to give. Mm -hmm. Unless she fouls it off. All right. That'll be... Oh, oh they're, call, they're See, calling strike three. He, he, didn't, didn't. he didn't motion for anything, so... That's cool. So that'll bring us to the bottom of the seventh inning. The Braves with their last chance here. Down, down three. three. Gonna, gonna definitely be an interesting one. So we'll take a short break. Be right back to the action. See if we can walk off winner here. So leading off the last half inning here today is Avalyn Ethel. Unless we get tied up, then we'll go to extras. Well, the Lady Braves are looking for a tie. They're looking for a dub right here, right now. And it all starts right here, pitch to pitch. The first pitch was up, ball one. New pitcher into the game for the Spartans, Tamara Blackburn Kelly. She'll make the move to the bump. Looking to shut the door here for the Spartans. That one flipped in there. That was hard. Strike one. Good velo there. That's and that's going to be such a hard thing to adjust to if you're the Lady Braves. I mean, Steve uh, Stevens, you know, more of a pitch to contact uh, pitcher. Doesn't throw very hard. And then uh, Blackburn Kelly coming in here. She's pumping it in. Counts 2-1. Ethel just looking to get on any way she can. In the situation, you're down multiple runs. You just need base runners. Doesn't need to do too much. Swings and misses. One of that one is a healthy hack. Two and two. Blackburn Kelly with the wind up in the pitch. That one popped up. Uh oh, that might be trouble. Might be trouble. It's That's a drop. Oh, just foul. I don't, I don't know if that one got the line or not, but. The only thing that Ath 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 who? Ethel Ethel was happy about is that it wasn't caught. She got an extra life. Yep. Would have been real nice if that would have landed right. on the line. But she has a chance to 
Do it again. Man, that middle's wide open, dude. Oh, yeah. I went poked. Yep, just like that. Like I said. Tyson called it. Ooh. She good stop, though. <laughs> but we'll still get the single. There. So, infield single for Ethel. Leads off the inning with a single. That'll bring up Molly Doohan. Could be seeing a sacrifice situation here. Yeah. I mean, I don't know. Uh, Being I down think, three runs. Well, what I, do I think she's swinging for the fences. Maybe not for the fences. I think she's. Sw <laughs> I think she's sw swinging to get on base. No, I think I think fences. No, Showed no. bunt. You should show. Called strike one. And Blackburn Kelly's throwing hard. Yes, she is. Low and away. That one gets by. Ethel thought about it. Thinks better of it. Goes back to yeah, first. Good idea. Probably. You don't need to advance right now. Yeah, I mean, in this situation, you don't really <laughs> want to be tentative, but you don't want to be over aggressive and make mistakes because mistakes will end this game or, uh, for the Braves. Or Lady Braves, excuse me. One high and outside. 2 1. A walk here would also be great for doing. <laughs> Work a walk, turn it over to Fink. She's waiting on deck. Cut on and miss, strike two. You gotta put something in play here. You got to have to put something in play. Two two pitch. That was low. Good leave. Good leave. But come on. Big A B. Count runs full. This is a big A B right here. This is a big pitch. One foul. Good fight. Good fight. Good fight. Full count pitch. Here we go. And that'll be a strikeout. That's all right. That's all right. So first out of the inning. It's top of the order. Now we're good. Top of the order. Turns it over to Fink. There you go. That was one to get some revenge back. Yeah, that's for sure. She just a, doesn't she, need to be over aggressive. Doesn't need to she do needs too to much. She's a crank ball to the gap. Now one cut on a missed, and like I said, don't want to don't want to be over aggressive. Uh -uh. Be smart. I, I, I swear I, I just heard someone say don't, don't do, do too, too much. much. Yep, I, I agree with that guy who said it. Yep. That was Chase Fink. I can tell. Mm, I'm going to stay quiet. 1-1 one, one count here, one out. <laughs> Here's the pitch. That one fouled back. Count runs to one and two. Just got to put something in play here. I think right up the middle is, like you said, pretty wide open. Fink nope. showing bunt. And she swings and misses for the strikeout. That'll be the second out of this bottom seven. <clears throat> That'll bring up Addie Rotz. Two out rally, man. Two out rally. Yep. And our shortstop number four, Addie Ross. Jeez, the creek went out of here. First put the ball in play at this at this at this rate. That one. Good pitch. Cut on oh, and missed. That's, that's a good pitch. I think yeah, she definitely went around there. Strike one. Oh, one on the way. That one. Got to get it down. Hit. Looped right to nice. center field. Here we go. There we go. Two out single. Tenth hit of the Good game swing. for the Lady Braves. That'll bring up Audrey Johnson. Come on, Audrey. This is the Take him a repeat. 
Blackburn, Kelly with the pitch. That one in there, strike one. Cut on and miss, strike two. So the Braves down to their final strike. Just a bit late on that one. She got she to choke up here. Anything close, you got to be swinging. Here's pitch. And there we go. So that'll end it here. Braves are handed their first loss on the season by the Spartans. It was Blackburn Kelly came in and slammed the door for the save. Good game. A good, nice defensive game. But the Spartans in the end had a little too uh, defense, a little too good to overcome and got some timely hitting late. So that'll do it here. Braves take this uh, L6-3. to three. So that's all from us here in the booth. Thank you all so much for yep. tuning in. Tyson, anything you want to say? Nope. Uh, see you all, folks. Hope you have a good rest of your evening. Yep. Take care and God bless.